the first listener, John, of the day, I believe? Sure. Um, okay. So John says, I was asked to set something uh, up on my work, work Mac that I thought I would share. There are hidden settings that change how Wi-Fi connects. I was asked to run this, and we'll paste it in. Um, I'm not going to read the whole darn thing here. Uh, the default, uh, but it's a Wi-Fi configuration uh, or, or airport configuration utility buried deep within the system. Um, and the default setting, uh, so they have one parameter called join mode. Uh, and normally it's set to something called automatic. Uh, I wonder if it would help some people to force the Wi-Fi. Uh, you could also say join mode. So what he's suggesting is join mode equals strongest. So if you're having problems with your Wi-Fi, um, maybe running this will help. Yeah, that's interesting. Yeah, it's a big, long, convoluted command that's like just buried in like private frameworks or something on, on the Mac. But I, yeah, I remember being at like a Mac tech event and hearing and, and talking with a, a Wi-Fi person, you know, about, I don't know, there was something we were talking on the show about. And this was like 10 years ago about, you know, how you could tweak the Broadcom chips in certain devices. And he's like, you know, you can do it in Apple devices, too. There's just no GUI for it. You've got to know what to do. And I think this is what he was referring to, where you can really kind of dig in and and control exactly how your Mac is going to choose to interact with a Wi-Fi network. Yeah, because, oh, wait, like, so does this mean that instead of joining the Wi-Fi network that's at the top of your Wi-Fi list in the in the thing, it's going to join whatever it finds to be the strongest network? Because that's been a problem in the past, right? Mm -hmm. Where, you, you know, if you've got, if it can see three networks, and one is super weak, but it's at the top of your list. That's what it's going to join. And we've always mm -hmm. kind of lamented that. So, oh, now I, huh. Okay. This might be a really good thing to set. I'm curious yeah. to hear. Yeah. Brian Monroe found what we were looking for. I believe he found uh, an article at uh, OS 10 daily, OS X daily, I should say. That is uh, Airport, the little known command line wireless utility for the Mac. And it seems like it has at least some of these commands in the in the article. So, yeah, it's telling us to use that same private frameworks thing. And uh, and then you can do Airport dash S. Oh, and get all the SSIDs from things. You can do dash I to get information and uh, and then it looks like, yeah, here you go. So the on the join mode, you get automatic, preferred, ranked, recent, strongest. And then you've got join mode fallback. So, yes, tons of these commands are there. Oh, amazing. Thank you, Brian Monroe. I love this. Love it. I love the real time feedback, too. This is uh, this is great. This is great. I knew it was out there. It had to be out there.